A robotic pushing is a fundamental non-prehensile manipulation skill for handling ungraspable objects without any task-specific tools or complex strategies. To adapt the robotic pushing skill in real applications, the following three requirements must be satisfied. First, the target object needs to be controlled accurately along with a given nominal trajectory. It is the main objective and challenging in robotic pushing field because the pushing system is hybrid and under-actuated system under complex and stochastic frictional effects. So, we need a sophisticated control strategy and a pushing motion model. Second, all processes must be performed online because offline process is not desirable in real applications. Third, the robotic pushing framework must be generalized on novel objects for real-world applications. So, we proposed an accurate robotic pushing framework by combining an online model estimation algorithm and an MPC-based pushing strategy using generalized analytical models. Here, we assumed that we know objects' contour information and can track objects' pose at each time steps. Also, we assume that the pushing system is a quasi-static which means we can neglect the inertial effects. For online model estimation, we utilized unscented Kalman filter as an online parameter estimator. We used previous M observations to estimate the optimal model parameters. Also, we used generalized form of conventional analytical pushing motion models in both model parameter estimation and MPC process. The main difference is the body frame and the center of friction frame are decoupled to describe real-world objects' local behavior accurately. To evaluate the proposed robotic pushing framework, we compared ours with two conventional MPC-based robotic pushing frameworks. The first method uses a conventional analytical model with fixed model parameters. The second method uses a Gaussian process-based data-driven model. Here, the offline collected dataset was used to train the GP model. We performed four different experiment conditions and repeated 15 times for each. The given task is tracking the following curved shape nominal trajectory, and we measured the following four performance indices. In the first experiment, the pushing performances were compared without any model perturbations. We arrange the internal loads as follows so the position of the center of friction can be approximated to zero. Also, this setup is the same as the data collection environment for training the data-driven model. The results of position error and orientation errors are as follow. In this experiment, the data-driven and proposed online estimated model show similar pushing performances. However, the fixed model shows slightly degraded performance, and it is due to the unreliable underlying assumptions of the conventional analytical model. In the second experiment, we perturbed the model by rearranging the internal loads and adding the external load while pushing. So, the fixed model used wrong model parameters and data-driven model encounter the different from the data collection environment. Here, the estimated position of center of friction is depicted. We can see that the estimated values are rapidly changed after the external load is added. The results of position error and orientation errors are as follow. In this experiment, the fixed model and data-driven model show extremely degraded performance while proposed method shows similar performance to the experiment one. We can verify that the proposed tried to find optimal model parameters to model the previous observations in every time step, so it can be rapidly adapted under the instantaneous model perturbations. In the third experiment, the model is perturbed by a combinative different contact surface. So, the fixed model also use wrong model parameters and data-driven model also encounter the different from the data collection environment. The results of position error and orientation errors are as follow. In this experiment, the proposed also outperformed both the fixed and data-driven. We can verify that the proposed tried to find optimal model parameters based on previous observations in every time step, so it can be adapted under the continuous model perturbations. In the fourth experiment, we used a different shape object under instantaneous model perturbation by rearranging the internal loads positions. So, the fixed model uses the raw model. Here, the estimated position of the center of friction is depicted. We can see that the estimated values rapidly change and converge around the specific region. The results of position error and orientation errors are as follows. In this experiment, the fixed model shows more degraded performance than proposed. We can verify that the proposed can also be adapted even though the pushing object has a different shape. Finally, the applicability of the proposed robotic pushing framework to real-world applications is demonstrated through an autonomous dishware collection task. If no graspable dishware is found, push an ungraspable dishware item towards the table's edge and verify its graspability. In this letter, we proposed an accurate robotic pushing framework using an on-any estimated model to push objects under uncertain object properties.
To improve the pushing performance under the uncertain object properties, we suggested a more reliable pushing motion model that combined the generalized analytical model and unscented Kalman filter-based online parameter estimation. We performed various sets of real robot pushing experiments, and we showed that the proposed robotic pushing framework outperformed the two MPC-based robotic pushing framework baselines under the uncertain object properties.